making his way to the car, weighing in at 225 pounds, from Livonia, Michigan, give it up for Electric Eric Ely. What the hell? Who is this guy? What the hell's going on here? One, bodybuilder Pizza Hut pizza. Double grilled chicken, double grilled jalapenos, acquired with electric Ely jump cut. <laughs> That's right, ladies and gentlemen, the electric one Woo in the back seat, our first professional wrestler. Yeah, I feel on the show. This is the first time I feel like I've had, I feel like this car is now a Prius. <laughs> I like that you went Prius and not Tesla. Oh, I don't believe in Tesla. <laughs> so today, uh, he's got a big match September 14th coming up against Drizako, the sexiest man in the room. I mean, that's a story for another day if you want to talk about that, but uh, yeah. I saw a recent promo he cut on you saying that you're too obsessed with your muscles, you're not obsessed with <laughs> the actual art of wrestling. I heard Electric Eric Ely talking a lot of crap about the sexiest man in the room, Drizako, talking about how I don't train enough, how I use women's hair care product. You know what? That's okay, because the women love my hair, and it's fluffy and nice. Unlike your stale, disgusting, decrepit hair, I've been in the house of truth busting my ass for our match. I don't see you here. I don't see you here doing the work that I'm doing. So how about September 14th? How about you don't make it about all oh, your muscles? How about you make it about the wrestling, but I doubt that you can, because whether you'd like to admit it or not, you're the real narcissist. You're the real bad guy. So he can keep putting uh, that stuff from Alta on his hair and, uh, <laughs> and uh, keep combing it and stroking it and uh, do what he has to do, but um, you lost me four straight times and you want to go for a fifth one? That's fine, man. Let's have a wrestling match this time, huh? No steel chair shots to the head. Just me and you so I continue for the fifth and hopefully final time. He will not beat me in the ring, I'll tell you that. He's gotten a lot of sky highs. He definitely knows how to uh, take the pin and be on his back. I will just say that <laughs> in the nicest way possible. I know we have a lot of professional wrestling fans, so so excited for you guys to see this. I'm actually wearing a super villain shirt. Electric Ely actually got me this after the Jericho Cruise became obsessed yeah. with these guys. Um, but if you're here for the food, uh, one of Electric Ely's cheat meals after a big uh, match is a pizza, right? You love Ooh. a good pizza. Yeah, so usually I get out of the, get out of my match around like 11, 11.30. I help take down the ring, take uh, put in my dues and all that, and I'm like, I gotta get some pizza. But I need some protein on it, and I need some spice. So you gotta go grilled chicken jalapeno. Money move. So we got Pizza Hut, we got the Hut favorite crust. We're gonna take you in real quick for a Corey Wagner second angle on this bodybuilding pizza pie. All right, let's take a look there. Ooh. <laughs> got a Corey's big man in this car. Corey's got crammed a big in. Big man in this yeah. car. All right, so we're seeing a classic Pizza Hut pizza. It's looking good. We want the pan style. The chicken on here is massive, big old clumps of chicken, just absolutely littered with jalapenos. They really didn't hold back when it came to getting the ingredients on this bad boy. They did it well, and they did a fine and fantastic job. Cheese is looking good, and we're seeing the little crispy crust that you'll tend to get on the uh, pan pizzas. All, yeah. all looking pretty tasty. So all in with double of, of both with no promo code. This pizza's right around 24 bucks. Mm. So we went double, double of both. both. We though. went that, double both no, with no a promo pa code. That's a Papa John's regular pepperoni. It kind of is. You know, it kind of this is. is double of both. That's not a bad price for double double ingredients. When, not at all. Can you hold this box, maybe? Have the chicken Come looks baby. good. I said maybe. <laughs> Can you hold the box, baby? I love the hot favorite seasoning. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the bodybuilding pie with the electric Eric Ely in the back seat, boys. Cheers. 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 Good luck, September 14th. Sure. Oh yeah. Oh. 
Mm, their sauce is good. It really is. I love Pizza Hut. They have I a do very too. like electric sauce. <laughs> oh, yours is pretty spicy. I know. And you always gotta go double a Pizza Hut. Yeah. I found that. They don't, like this is a good amount, but think about having that, like halving, H-A-L-V-I-N-G. Mm -hmm. uh, it's way better. And I love how they char them up. Yeah. They're not just sitting on their raw. I like how they grill them a little bit. They go, well no, they're grill them. They go through the pizza oven. They do have a little kick to them, huh? Mm-hmm. I remember growing up, we used to get Pizza Hut all the time. Where we get double pepperoni and we, you couldn't even see the cheese. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. Pizza Hut too. Mm -hmm. Wow, this crust is buttery. It's so good. This is good. I love Pizza Hut. Uh, it's good. How many like grams of? It gets a very bad rap now. It does. I don't know why. I don't know why either. It's so much better than uh, Papa John's and Domino's. I agree. I absolutely love this crust. Me, Me too. too. How many grams of protein do you eat a day normally? You're a very uh, macro heavy assessor. You know how many of everything. So I'm 225 pounds. I heard so, the intro, yeah. Yeah. So, um, I want to get, per body weight, so I want to get one gram, one and a half grams of protein per body weight. <laughs> per pound? Yeah. So let's real quick so talk good. about your moveset. Mm -hmm. The sky high is your finisher. <laughs> so I'm sky high. <laughs> For the wrestling fans out there, um, yes, I would love another slice. Thank you. If you watched uh, Mark you Henry back yeah. in the day. Mark Henry, yep. He's retired. The world's now. strongest man. He's a Hall of Famer. Um, he did the world's strongest slam. Oh yeah. I do the world's Ooh. most electric slam. You sure do. Ooh. Look at and that. And then I also, it. if you guys watch uh, Braun Strowman or the British Bulldog for yep. the old school, mm -hmm. I do the running power slam too. Those all sounded like they could be dog breed. <laughs> the electric one is actually a huge dog fan. Yeah, <laughs> those are my my main my main moves. But I'm always looking for new stuff. I started doing the Cesaro swing. Yeah, I saw you do the swing in one of your recent yeah, matches. I did, I did that on Trezeco, and he took the pin in that match. <laughs> he took the pin. No. That first match, so I'm sitting on my couch in Chicago and Electric, the Electric Eric Ely has his first match. My buddy who I worked at the State News with back in college just happens to be like a ring announcer. What? Sends That's me awesome. Sends me the full video. Moments after his match is over, I start crying like a little oh baby. Because this dude is just so naturally has it. You see somebody like, I've watched WWE for a long time and you just see guys that like, don't don't take yep. moves right, don't take bumps. And I watched Eric's first match and I was like, dude, this is incredible. I bet there's a lot of people who cry sitting at home watching wrestling matches. It's all people I like. <laughs> you guys heard of The Undertaker? Rest in peace. Yeah. I remember him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, but um, after that first match, um, I appreciate it. it was your dragging greed was my first opponent. Yeah. Um, awesome guy. After the match, he goes, so was, was that like one of your first matches? I go, that was my very first match. He goes, wait, that was your first match? I go, yeah. He goes, I could not tell. He goes, you had. That's like, so sick. That was a huge comment. Oh, that's awesome. That's so and sick. And then I had my trainer, Mysterious Movado. Shout out to him, Josh. Yeah. Love you. Um, he was in the back right when I got through the curtain. He hugged me. First know. time I had sex, my uncle said that to me too. <laughs> what did he say? First time? <laughs> <laughs> he murdered someone. Take him to jail. You guys are weird. Oh, God. How about the drawer of the second slice? <laughs> <laughs> and quick pivot. <laughs> I can't get over how good this is. Yeah. It's really good. The chicken on there is massive. I like that they put big old chicken blocks on there. Caesar's Much like out. that big old chicken block. That the electric Ely is gonna be fighting soon. That dude ain't nothing but old ground up meat. You have no idea what you're going up against if you say yes to this match September 14th. I've lost to this man four times, four times, and I am absolutely, absolutely done. Book it. I accept. September 14th, I want him one on one. Yeah! Bomb ass, bomb. The ugliest man in the room. <laughs> Poor Jezekiel. 
You should try to cut a clump of it off during the Yeah. Battle. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> In your tights, just pull out scissors. <laughs> oh, and the electric one's got the, the kitchen scissors. Brutus Beefcake, uh, uh, 2019. Just start cutting his locks off. I would say five, six years ago, I hated Pizza Hut and Little Caesars just because it was just like, oh, you know, blah, blah. Now yeah. it's like my two of my favorites again. Yeah. What were your favorites back then? Hungry Been, Howie's is Hungry Howie's is so Hungry good. Hungry yeah. and Jats were... Yeah, that's, that's too really, really good. Mm -hmm. on, on Wednesdays growing up, um, there was a deal at Hungry Howie's called Wacky Wednesday. Eric would always call my mom as soon as he got home from school. Yeah. Mom, can we get Wacky Wednesdays it was, today? It was two medium pizza, uh, pizzas, one topping. We always get pepperoni with butter cheese crust. It was like 10 bucks. 10 bucks, yeah. Yo, browser freak, drop the mouse and get out of the house. It's Wacky Wednesday at Hungry Howie's. That means you can get a large cheese pizza for only $4.99. Hungry Howie's, great crust. Yeah, shout out to Hungry Howie's. And it was the best because uh, once we got it, we, we'd always had leftovers for school. For yeah. Oh, yeah. oh my God, you get to take some pizza into yeah. school? Yep. Whew, was that fun. I feel like Hungry Howie's was kind of the originator of like flavored crusts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. They were the first place that I remember going that they were like, what do you want on your crust? Spit on it with God's loogies, dude. Mm -hmm. We'll put anything you want on there. Yeah. It's like, all right, sweet. Eric, real quick, calling this, instead of a lightning round, this is the electric round. All right. Ready? Ooh. Favorite finishing move of all time? Stone Cold Stunner. That right. Oh, no, no! That's Favorite intro of all time? I'm probably going Undertaker. Favorite tag team duo of all time? New Age Outlaws. Tag team duo! Best heel? Chris Jericho. You just made the list! Best face? John Cena. There's only one rule, step up or step aside. Most memorable return? I would say The Rock, that was what, 2011, I could be wrong, when he came back as the special guest for Mania and then he ended up beating Punk. Um, and he had those two matches with Cena at back to back WrestleMania, so I would say The Rock. You are losers. You do not get to win. You hurt this man. And the final one best commentator Jim Ross. Like, Jim Ross. Come on. I have a gift for you guys. Ooh. What? You got a gift? Are you gonna power slam us both? <laughs> he donks our heads together. Oh, sick, dude. Ooh, glow in the dark? Right yeah. on, dude. Glow in the dark, so Casey. Dude, I'll tell you what, oh. 2002 Corey Wagner would have loved that. Losing his mind right now. <laughs> so you give these out and sell them at your matches, right? Yeah, so my. You got some sick merch. In my entrance, Is that another Ely? Yeah, if you want. <laughs> In my entrance, if you want to do a clip of that, you can. Um, yeah. I give out my sunglasses to a young fan in the crowd, which was today was him. <laughs> I thought I was getting sexually assaulted. <laughs> hey, what the hell? Who, who is this guy? What the hell's going on here? And then uh, I throw a couple of my electric Ely wristbands to usually. Do you ever uh, aim at people? Do you fling them like yes. rubber bands? Oh, no, yeah. No, I'd be no, aiming I'd, for I'd, people. I'd toss them. I'd be like, bro, I'm trying to take an eye out. <laughs> uh, last show, I did throw one and hit a guy right in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Should have been paying attention. <laughs> Before we finalize this video with a little bit of links of how to go see Eric on September 14th against Rizekio, real quick, let's do a little shirt shout out, shirt shout out, shirt shout out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. People that bought merchandise off number six with cheese.com. You got three shout outs today because Electric Eric Ely is here. Shirt shout out name number one. First off, this is a person we've shouted out before and I'm sure we're going to shout him out again Mr. Christopher Ball. Oh, I love this guy. Woo! Oh, Mr. Yeah. Gander. Yes. Uh, he got himself a Sure I'll Have a Drink shirt yep. and a blue koozie. Thank you so much, Man, Chris. what a G. Yeah. What a G. Shirt shout out number two, Mr. Jeff Rowe. Give it up for Woo! Jeff Rowe. Sure I'll have a drink shirt, a koozie, and stickers. That's a wow. three banger. Thank you, Jeff. Three banger. Shirt shout out number three goes to Robbie Harrington. Oh, Robbie, Robbie got himself a Sure I'll Have a Drink shirt and a jump cut shirt. And if you get a chance to tell your Uncle Joey that he ruined my uh, childhood, I'd appreciate that because I had high hopes for that draft pick. <laughs> Joey? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was rough. That was rough. That was rough, rough. Dude. He was on the cover of NCAA football. I yeah. thought he was going to be great. Oregon Ducks. I remember I saw oh. him in his like, Oregon days and I was like, this guy's the real deal. <laughs> He's the truth. Boy, was I wrong. 
And we got three Detroit sports fans in here, so there was a lot of hostility still yeah. creeping around. Lions ever yeah. had a good quarterback? And do not say Yeah, Charlie that Batch. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thank you so much, number 6 cheesecom But let's get to the rating. Eric, out of five what today? What are we going to cut out? What image? Because I'm so appreciative of my trainer, Mysterious Movado, let's do out of five Mysterious Movado masks. Ooh. Out of five Mysterious Movado masks, how many Mysterious Movado masks do you give the bodybuilder pizza, double chicken, double jalapenos, uh, Pizza Hut's hot favorite, uh, crust, all of that stuff, tier today, electric. Eric Ely, what do you give it? For a Pizza Hut pizza, a chain pizza, with like the seasonings on the chicken and like the spice of the jalapenos and that crust, I'm I'm going for Mysterious Movado Mask. That's a, Dude, that's eighty percent. That's a good score. Excellent score. Same question to you, Mr. Corey Wagner. Dude, the chunks of chicken were so massive in it. The jalapeno and chicken were so plentiful. Their sauce is so good, and I love that pan crust. It's a little more expensive, but it, they made it worth our while by giving us so many toppings. I gotta go with the exact same score. That's all a right, four banger. Right, that's a good right. score. Keep in mind, Pizza Hut recently reinvented their pan pizza. They're doing it a little differently, and I think the change is amazing. I used to skip over it. I would only get hand-tossed. I think their pan is killing it. I'm going 4.25. Yeah, that's Ooh. a great, I mean, it's a great pizza. I'm really and happy Especially, with that. I already feel stronger. I might just go and do some push-ups the rest of the day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, what do you know, you know? What do you know? I know that information. <laughs> <laughs> All right, before we get out of here, September 14th, Electric Eric Ely versus the sexiest man in the room, Drizakio. So let me ask this question. So say someone can't make it on the 14th, but they want to look out for other matches that he has. Is there like a preferred platform or like something for them to follow you to find future matches? Facebook, Electric Ely. I post photos, event updates on there, and also Instagram, Eric Ron Ely. A lot of promos on there. Yeah, Heck a lot yeah. of promos. Just just mostly wrestling, some personal stuff on Instagram, but um, yeah, but yeah, it, it just shows you know inside my life, and it's I'm all real. Definitely check those out, especially if you can't make it to the September 14th. He's gonna have plenty of matches to come in the future. Yes, sir. And one last question before we get out of this sweaty car with three dudes, one guy. Your dream indie match right Ooh. now. If you could pick one guy to wrestle, who is that wrestler? Corey Wagner. <laughs> <laughs> What kind of match would you want Eric in? It would just be like a chair match? Ah, ah, ah. In a no screen match? Eric, who um, is it? I'm gonna keep it local. I'm gonna go Michigan. There's one guy in my mind. He will match up well with me. Strengths, uh, size, agility. Dread King Logan. Dread Ooh. King Logan. Whoa. Dread King, the electric Eric Ely wants Let's you. Let's do it. One it's on money. one. It's money. You're gonna lose. It's a risky match to take, Mr. Dread King. It is. But I it suggest is. you do it for the fans. But you know, when you wrestle Eric, the crowd's packed. This dude crowd's brings packed. people to the matches. That's the best thing. That's why he gets booked. He brings people and they are fired I mean, up. We don't have people on our show who aren't uh, who don't, don't have a little audience, you know? That's a good point. That's a good point. So, uh, Eric, thank you so much for doing the show. It was great having Thanks you in the back me. seat. Thanks for having some uh, some chain pizza pie with us. And uh, check one of the electric Eric Ely's matches. And uh, all of his links are below. And we'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video of Number Six with Cheese. Woohoo! I need a shower. Bro. You boys ready to hit the showers? I can't wait to wring out my shirt. <laughs> Bye.